Hello out there, wherever you are. I'm smoking my Peterson Ruse Law. I would say it's a, a medium pricey pipe. It go for about 175 seems to be the magic number. Uh, between 175 and 200. The, I notice that a lot of pipe shops don't keep them in regularly. So I ordered mine off the internet. I got it new. A while back. It come with a nice uh, sterling silver band that's hallmarked and uh, yeah, it says Peterson's Dublin on the, on the stem. I guess you would call it a pot. It's a pot shape. So if you can find one cheap Snatch them right up because it's a great pipe. Very photogenic. Shows up well on film. I'd pre pack this. Uh, and I got myself comfortable in the chair. And uh, I was going to show my. Molly Barling. Which I'll feature in another video. It's a yeah, I didn't wanna go pick another tobacco I came right to the end of this. MA's the light, that's what it's called. And uh those that follow me, I hardly need any explanation. It's from M.A.'s uh, Tobacco Shop in Shreveport, Louisiana. The tobacco, you know. So I didn't want to go up and pick another tobacco and stuff that pipe, so I'm sticking with this. Nice smoke that, you know, um, M.A.'s Delight. I was also uh, thinking about getting some IQ from them, uh, which I'm told is very good, too. I've noticed that mine and some other folks' subscribers disappeared. It's not zero, like they all left. It's just, it's not up there. I can't check my, I can't check my subscribers and click them on. I've got to remember them all. <laughs> it's like 120. Okay, maybe it's some uh, quarterly, semi-annual, something like, see, I haven't been on. Uh, I'm relatively new to the pipe community, so I haven't been on uh, more than a couple months. I think it was around January 13th that I started doing a video, so I don't know whether they're updating stuff or whatever. Very gentle smoke, very nice, no bite. It's a good drawing pipe too, that's another reason I showed this one today. I had it up once before, I think, a while back. But these guys are great. Sharp looking pipe. Uh, gets a lot of comments. And uh, 
so far so that's why I'm popping on today hmm. hope you're all finding yourself well of course for those of you with uh, some infirmaries permities uh, God bless and uh, praying for you Good smoke, very good. I mean, any any pipe basically with a good draw is gonna smoke well, quote unquote, unless it's, unless it's all gum, gunked up. you know if you smoke a whole bunch of aromatics in there it might not give the true taste of the tobacco that you're smoking I was going to do a pipe smoking and choosing a pipe for beginners but there's so many of them out there you know uh, I decided against it for right now maybe I will uh, at a later date I know some of you have these great productions uh, that are that are quite good, you know, like Sparky's Pipes. I like his intro, uh, you know, with the John Wayne uh, thing in the background. It's a, not a bad day out. The sun's trying to peek through, but it's... Uh, I guess partially sunny out there today in southeastern Pennsylvania. We're in a little pocket, like I've mentioned before. We we don't get hit as much, uh, but you go like 20, 30, 40 miles north of here, like an Allen, a place called Allentown. Remember that Billy Joel song? And we're living in Allentown. Well, that's not too far. But you'll see the snow uh, up there this time of year. So I believe this is the second day of spring. It's a little chilly out there. I think it's like 35, 30. Yeah, average uh, temperature last year was in the low 50s. showing this fine pipe today than rambling on like I did yesterday. You know, I just mix it up a little bit. But there are things uh, to talk about. So I've started writing some of you back. Uh, what I do because my eyesight's a little, you know, it's age related really. I mean, it's something to do with diabetes, but I don't feel like I'm getting blind or anything. But I have close vision isn't what it used to be. So what I'm doing now is when I, when I compose my uh, response or if I say hello, you know, for the first time. So, what, what I'm doing now is I go to the uh, 
settings thing and, and, and raise the, you know, raise the block up, you know, zoom in and it's good for reading and responding. I can't, you know, do one of these and then if I write like four sentences or a paragraph, it would be taking me 40 minutes to hunt and pack that thing out, so. I usually like to respond later in the evening. It's sort of, uh, yeah, it gets me nice and tired. I sit by the, by the edge of my bed and, and type stuff out, so. By the time I'm doing a few of those, I've, uh, I'm sleepy enough to pop back in bed and call it a night. That's how they roll, as they say. I found something interesting for those folks that, uh, I, th I think, uh, I don't want to misquote anybody, but I thought Henry sent was, uh, getting a, uh, a scooter from the scooter store. Now, you see this chair? This is, uh, good general information. If... You have Medicare and they paid for a, say, electric wheelchair or a scooter. They won't help pay for a lift chair. They'll just do one uh, device uh, when it comes to these power chairs slash scooters or electric wheelchairs. And, uh, and then the doctor has to write a prescription out. Uh, but you can have one or the other. In other words, I can't have partial payment for this chair here, which is the Pride Lip Chair. It goes all the way back. And uh, it has electric control. But the uh, Medicare won't pay for both. Just one device. So keep that in mind. Or, uh, you know, you'll be wasting your time applying for... Uh, you know, reimbursement. There's a little general knowledge going out there. Using my little Jeep lighter. Remember the D is silent. The Jeep. If you were to read it off, but it's, it's a Jeep. Disposal. Runs about two bucks. I like them better than Bix. And I'm, uh, I'm going to get an old boy lighter. Uh, I like the, either the, the gray or the, the gold <clears throat> with the pipe chart on it. The, the unadorned uh, old boys, the genuine, I, I found one on eBay for 102 but the average, I think, is uh, about 130, roughly. And I had a, a, a blazer lighter for a long time, but finally wore out. A little blazer torch. Comes with a little stand. You can actually use it as a soldering device or something. Well, that's going to wrap it up for today's uh, talk. Uh, stay tuned and happy smoking.